Let's review for a minute what a Moodle role actually is. A role is an assignment given to a user in Moodle that determines what permissions they have across the site. There are different contexts in Moodle. Context meaning the front page is different from being inside a course, which is different from being inside a user profile. Those contexts all can have different roles and permissions assigned to a user. This is what allows, for example, Jane Moodler to be a student in one page and maybe a teacher in another. She has a different role. So how are roles assigned in Moodle 2.0? Let's head back to the front page to start. Most of the roles editing you'll be doing is inside a course page. If you're the teacher of a course page, you might, for example, assign students into the student role of your page, ensuring that they can only participate in your course. They can't make changes. How can we enroll students in our course or assign users the student role? Locate your settings block when you're on your course page. In Moodle 1.9, you might have referred to this as your administration block. And where you used to have a link that said assign roles, now you have a users item that you can expand. Clicking on enrolled users allows you to see who's participating in your course and what permissions or roles they have. Right now, no one is assigned to my course. Let's enroll some people. I'm going to click enroll users on the side and a window pops up in the center, which is far different than before. This window allows me to see everyone on my site and enroll them if I want. If I'd like to narrow down the field, I can search for Jane Moodler, who I'd like to assign to this course. Then I can pick Enroll. Before I do so, let's take a look at exactly what role we're giving Jane Moodler. At the top, you have a menu where you can choose exactly how many permissions Jane Moodler can have. I'd like to assign her the student role. Further enrollment options, such as how long the person is enrolled, or recover old grades if I'm re-enrolling them in my course, are in this enrollment options section. Okay, I'm ready to enroll Jane Moodler. I click Enroll, and she now becomes a part of my course. Close this window, and my enrolled user list expands to show that Jane Moodler is included. Back on my course page, if I visit my settings block and expand that users section again, what else can I do to determine the roles and permissions in my course? We know that enrolled users allows us to adjust who's participating in our course. Enrollment methods allows me to customize how users can sign up for my course. Manual enrollments means that I'm the only one who can enroll a student in this course. If I'd like them to have guest access or be able to enroll themselves, assign themselves the student role in my course, this is where I add those methods. If I'd like this course to be guest accessible, I'll choose guest access and then turn it on by opening the eye. In the past, only in the course settings did you determine if a student could access your page as a guest. Now it's part of the enrollment methods. If you're ever unsure of the permissions that your account has been assigned, talk to your Moodle administrator and ask them to audit your permissions. The administrator can do this by logging in with their admin account, visiting a user's profile, then in the settings area, under roles, ask for this user's role assignments or click check permissions. This will tell you what this user is able to do and where. That's roles in Moodle 2.0.